Hello again, viewers. In the midst of pandemic, students need to continue their studies because we all know that continuous studying helps students to know or choose their path in life. In order to achieve that, it is important to have a plan or what we call career plan. Education is a process of acquiring information and learning that they need to have the proper knowledge. Education is a big part of our lives because it helps us to have the knowledge that we need to acquire for our future career and plans. While career is an individual choice of job or occupation based on the knowledge and skills that they require, a career includes the education, training, and experiences that you have. Every individual has their career path based on the opportunities that they will take in the future. A career is important because it helps you to gain experience and practice. Your continuous learning skills for you to widen your knowledge about things that were not taught in school. Hello again! I am here to help you on how to make your career plan. So I have here the six steps in making a career plan. And without further ado, let's start! First, self-exploration and assessment are to create knowledgeable and educated students or professionals and vocational academic and career selections. You can determine or identify with the help of different assessments and evaluation tools for values, interest, personality, and attitude test. Second, career research is one can investigate various kinds of career or occupations that seem to be interesting after evaluating your characteristics and propensities. Establish a selection of professions and companies or sectors that supplied from the evaluations and make a checklist of the workplace culture, qualities, tasks, and career progressions, chances that you desire. Third, career exploration and experimentation are by exploring the possibility to encounter every profession in reality once you've cut down the um, your options of probable occupations. Individuals may investigate and engage with the position they love and prefer by performing applications, work watching, volunteering, internship, part-time employment, seeking a supervisor or a mentor, and picking courses based on their studies. Fourth, decision-making and career selection are to evaluate the merits and drawbacks of every one of your potential choices. Multiple aspects must be considered such as prospective remuneration ratios, relocating advantages and drawbacks, and job equilibrium. Fifth, the final planning and action are to compile every one of the data that you've gathered and develop a strategy. The approach must include details about your work, record, school, degree of expertise, volunteer activities, and other compensated experiences. Create detailed outlines of brief term and long objectives to complete before achieving your ultimate career objective. Last but not the least, job search and acceptance is to commence your quest for work with your professional strategy. You also can utilize the main objective technique and life plan to produce a successful job application that reflects your enthusiasm for the position, industry, and company, or double check if you employed the SMART approach correctly. If you prefer a proposal of employment, then just grab it. If you are denied, you should understand and start a fresh phase of career planning. Having a career is also important to developing a career plan because it provides much needed direction and clarifies where you see yourself in the future. It makes you aware of your strengths and weaknesses and the skills and knowledge that are required to achieve your goals in the future. 
Most significantly, it will guide you when you're considering a career or industry change by assisting you in determining whether your choice is actually in line with the plan.